All right, I know some of us that have been flying the new 182 have had an issue with headset volume on the co-pilot side. When the pilot has the volume set so it works well on his or her headset, the co-pilot side cannot hear anything. I called the people that installed our avionics today and talked to a person that said, on the co-pilot side of the aircraft, on our audio panel controls here, what you do to adjust your volume is, as you go down to these knobs at the bottom and the big, the outer knob, the big one, when you twist it, you'll see that is the crew ICS that's flashing right there. Now that you have the crew ICS flashing, you go down to the smaller knob on the audio panel and you can see just above my fingers, the volume's reducing for that particular setting for the ICE crew ICS. So then you could go to the big knob again and cycle it, and now it's flashing on aux, which would be for our TDFM. So now we go to the small knob and we start making adjustments. And it should remember each separate input that you adjust the volume for. So now I'm on COM1 and I'm going to adjust that all the way up just for demonstration purposes. Now I'm going to go to, I'm cycling back to passenger ICS. Now I'm back up to crew. And if I remember, I set the aux very low on the TDFM. And if I turn the big knob again to COM1, it should be a high setting. So there it does set. So you can see I set the aux low. I set COM1 high. So it does remember which radio you're listening to and what volume setting you had it on. If any of you have any questions about how this works, give me an email or a call and I'll explain it to you. But it's pretty straightforward once you take a look and just a disclaimer I have not put headsets on yet to try this but this is how I was told to control your volume on the co-pilot side in our new 182 November 802 Charlie Papa hope you're all having a great day talk to you later bye